going on guys it's kingman welcome back to the channel today i'm going to be showing you a tombstone soda wall breach method on firebase zombies so what you're going to need is the tombstone perk and a friend make your way to my location you want to go to the huge ball on the map firebase c you then just want to go up these stairs and once you go up the stairs what you want to do is just face this door you then just want to uh, kill yourself with a frag grenade or any type of lethal or you can use a zombie to down you once you are down you then just want to hold triangle to go in your tombstone shadow and once you've done that you want to get your friend in position to help you with this glitch so to do this glitch you once you're in the tombstone shadow what you want to do is find uh, a mantle point so the thinner the railing the better the more better you breach so as you see here my friend's going to go up to my dead body so he can res me and what he wants to do he wants to tell you when he's resing you and as soon as that white bar hits the end you want a mantle and once you've done that you've done it correctly you will mantle straight through any wall this literally works on any wall so i see here i'm now reviving um scar and as soon as that hits the end he mantles that thin railing i mantled earlier so this is quite hard to get down but once you do it you're gonna be rolling and you're gonna be doing pretty much anywhere but actually here i'm now in here it's completely sick but i've got some news to show you and i've got some intel in here to show you so i'm very sorry if i spoiled this to you um as you see here i'm now gonna roll the intel for you right now so sam do you realize what this is do you even know of course you don't so i'll tell you it's a gateway into the other world have you ever even dreamt of such a thing have you ever imagined what it would be like if everything you knew to be true was just turned upside down, changed forever? That's what this represents. It's a door to another world, one that could enrich or destroy everything depending on who holds the keys. Look at you. Resolute. Stubborn. Your silence isn't going to help you in any way, you know. In fact, it's just going to make things worse. We will find your informant, believe me. That's the funny thing about secrets. They can't stay secret forever. Sooner or later, they are always exposed, along with all their inherent beauty or ugliness. You know, I don't think you realize just how small of a cog you are in this machine. You're close to nothing, worthless. No one is coming for you, because no one cares about you. Honestly, I'm doing you and the world a favor. We are made from Earth, and we will return to Earth. Some of us sooner than others. From dust you are, and to dust you will return. I did hope you enjoyed that intel. But yeah, I did hope you enjoyed that little sneak peek of the intel inside of this dome. But I'm now going to show you the second glitch in the video. But as you see here, as you see, I hold my frag grenade, I die. I, en I then enter the shadow tombstone thing. And then I find a mantle spot. So as you see there, I was facing forward. So with this method, you have to think about like directions. Because as you see there, I was facing forward to do the glitch. And you want to find a mantle spot, which is... In the same direction of that glitch so say if a, uh, a, gl a wall was facing to the right i want to find a mantle which is in the same direction of that glitch it's very hard to explain guys i'm trying to explain this as much as i can you're literally once you do this you'll start to understand so say if i was like doing a glitch and i was facing forward if i then do a mantle um say if i looked backwards to do a mantle and then my friend revives me i will then mantle backwards while i'm trying to breach forward if you get what i mean it's very hard to explain i'm trying to explain it much as possible but if you face forward make sure you mantle forward towards where you want to breach so do it in the same direction as what i'm trying to say it's very hard to explain on the video but once you do this glitch trust me you'll understand it a bit better but i'm trying to explain it much as possible so say if i was doing a glitch on the right you want to do the mantle in the same direction as that glitch if you get what i mean and the thinner the railing the better so i forgot to mention so the thinner the railing the better i've already mentioned this but also say if i was mantling like over a railing and then i drop down to like a steep kind of like floor um pretty much that gets added uh, like added on to when you breach so say if i wanted to do the dome glitch and i mantled it like off a small thin railing off a roof and landed on the floor that would be added on to when I wall breach in the dome if you get what I mean so whatever mantle you do that'll be the mantle you do 
what you're trying to breach into if you get what I mean so whatever mantle you do in the tombstone shadow is the mantle you'll be doing to breach the wall that's what I'm trying to say so yeah guys I do hope you enjoy this video I hope I explain this as much as possible to you and I really hope you understand if not I will try and talk to you in the comments to help you guys hope you enjoyed me breaching inside of the dome and breaching inside the secret room I'm coming for hope you enjoyed the video Smash the like button and subscribe if you're new. Peace out.